Okay, hello, this is Tibbles. Um, I'm going to be showing you how exactly this KA-52 works. <clears throat> so as you can see, when you spawn it, it spawns frozen, one prop, unfreeze it. Um, now there is an E2. In multiplayer you need to update it, but in single player you don't. It has to do with E2 holograms and anti-minge stuff. So there's this E2 that's uncolored. Just simply open it up, re-upload it. It's for the landing gear, otherwise the landing gear would get all messed up. So it's pretty easy. You just get in. Ooh, nice bloom. Um, the helicopter starts up, it takes about five seconds. Um, normally the GP's working, I have no clue why it's not working in this video right now. So controls are space is up, shift is down, so W goes forward. You can hold W in space to kind of go up and forward and get more speed. Um, it rolls and yaws at the exact same time. So as you can see, it gets a nice little easy to control feeling here. So you can just fly around. You'll get the hang of the controllers really quick. Um, so as you can see, the landing gear automatically retract and deploy. So um, about the turret is you just get in the second seat. Is mouse aimed? Um, I actually am gonna add a. HUD and a, you know, a little aimer. So, pretty simple. Left click fires. Really accurate. Um, it moves 100% independent from the helicopter itself. So, as this is flying, the angles aren't going to be changing. It's just going to be moving positions. Right click, shoot unguided FFAR missiles. And you can do both. So as you can see, that's pretty much the basis of it. Just remember to update that E2. And uh, you're good to go. Good to fly, so I'll be releasing this dupe. Thank you.